Hi, Mom. Yeah. No, can you pick up Chris after school? Yeah, I'm, I'm at the doctor's. Mrs. Harris? Describe your symptoms. H hang on. Stress, headaches, nausea. Yeah, well, I work on Saturdays. And how long has this been? Equanimity. Balance your lifestyle. Good morning. Is this Suzanne Cantra? It is. How are you doing, Valder? I am so well. Thank you for joining us. I want my audience to know that you're the founder and editor-in-chief of Techlicious. And you're going to be talking about LG's hottest new smartphones today. What's going on with LG? They just keep putting out <laughs> these products. I can't keep up with them. Exactly. So there's a lot of excitement around the new release of the V20. So from a just a general Android perspective, it's the first phone that is built from the ground up to run Android 7.0 Nougat. And so it has all of the Nougat goodies in it. So things like Doze, so it's when, when it's in your pocket or when it's in your purse. It's going to go into sleep mode so you get extended battery life. It also will support split screen. So with a device like the V20, which has a 5.7 inch display, what you're seeing is the ability to read your recipe on one half of the screen and have your cooking timer on the other half. Um, also, with the LG V20, they have a secondary display. So this is going to be bigger and brighter, give you more information, let you reply to text messages while you're in another app. So really taking advantage of the fact that it is built from the ground up as an Android 7 Nougat device. So it's going to give me Windows features on my phone? Because that's really what you're saying. <laughs> yes, exactly. So side by side, you're going to be able to run two applications at the same time. So no more switching between applications and trying to remember phone numbers. I'm always texting somebody a phone number for some reason. Uh, so being able to look at your contacts and, and send that text, text message at the same time. Oh, boy, those millennials, though. I don't know if you're one. They got <laughs> that down. I get their whole phone book if I ask for a number. They've got that one <laughs> Yeah. Okay, exactly. Suzanne. Okay, so these smartphones, we're going to be looking for these features, but how is this going to benefit, benefit us as consumers? Because you know we're shelling out big bucks. That is really true. So when you think about what smartphones do today, they do so much more. So it's not just calls and texts, obviously. We're taking lots of photographs with them. We're taking videos and sharing them. We're listening to more music. And what manufacturers are doing is they are creating new technologies and new tools to let us have a better experience. So for instance, with the LG V20, they have a new technology called Steady Record 2.0. And what does is virtually eliminate that bouncy video that that we've all seen online, you know, our friends and families put up these videos of kids riding bikes and you get a little seasick watching them. Uh, this is going to eliminate that. It will also, in addition to that st stabilization, it will help track somebody within the frame. And so you're really going to be able to focus on the content in the video and not be distracted on the poor quality of the shooting anymore. Okay, so what are we listening to if they're going to stabilize the visuals? What are we doing audio-wise? So audio-wise, a lot of new technologies. For video, there is the ability to record at higher volumes. So we've all listened to those blown-out videos of people at this fantastic concert. Now you're going to be able to get that wide range of sound and be able to really share your experience. Same thing goes for ball games. So being able to, from a recording perspective, be able to really share those experiences. Now from the listening perspective, it's all also important to have great technology built into your phone. The best experience you can have with listening is having a corded headset plugged into your smartphone and you want to make sure that there's no noise and distortion in that audio. And so what we've seen with the V20 is that they built in what's called the Hi-Fi Quad Deck, which really means that it is taking out that noise and taking out that distortion that can happen between your phone and your headphones. You know Apple sets, kind of sets the tone for smartphones since they've made all this money. They've gone wireless with their headphones, 
Are we going to see that in a future version of an LG phone? So it, are, it still supports uh, Bluetooth, so you're going to be able to use your existing Bluetooth headphones, uh, be able to you know, go to the gym and work out, walk around, totally wireless. It's just if you want to have that elevated music experience, when you want to really listen to those lossless files so you feel like you're at the concert or in the recording studio, it has that too. All right. And what about the battery concerns on all of those phones? So with batteries, you know, we've seen some news about that. Really what we're looking at is making sure that you follow your manufacturer's suggestions. So don't go for those cheap cables. Don't cheap out on that. Make sure that you're using the ones that came in the box or something that's been certified by your manufacturer. And then when you're thinking about the, the charging scenario, you know, maybe you want to look at something like a V20 that has a replaceable battery. It just pops open. It looks exactly like a cosmetic case. You just use your thumb and it pops open nicely, swap out for a new battery. Uh, so there are lots of battery considerations and concerns. All right. And where would you send my audience for more information, Suzanne? You can go to lg.com slash v20. All right. No wonder they let you be the editor-in-chief at Techlicious. You know a lot. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so we cover everything from smartphones to fitness trackers, anything that helps people get more of the technology they already have, those tips and how-tos. Uh, so it's been fun, you know, talking to people over the last few years. I like what you do. Thank you so very much. Thank you.